the other morning. Check your look. Take a look at the garden. See how everything is still thriving. Still have flowers opening up to pollinate water. I found out something that you get rid of these fire ants. Beautiful sunflower. And it's a fly. It's an actual fly. Isn't that amazing? A fly. Yes, a fly that is going to lay its larva inside of the ant. When it does that, the larva inside the ant starts growing inside the ant. And then it'll actually pop off the head of the ant from the inside out. It's a tiny fly, but my understanding they can be a nuisance. I didn't know that. But I'd rather have the nuisance of a little tiny fly than to have the nuisance of fire ants popping up anywhere and without knowing it. Stung. At first, I didn't have allergic reaction, but now I keep getting allergic reactions when I get stung by the fire ant. Well, we look a little thirsty, so we're going to put some water subjects and then we'll be back I gave them some water and it has I just soaked the the roots so I want to just soak the roots and then I'll get the hose and I'll I'm going to use this repurposed bottle. Excuse me. Under here. Raise it up. Should go to the right. Well, it's been placed underneath. So, I may have to raise this end up right here in order for the water to flow all the way that way into this bucket. Well, I think we've got the slant going correctly. So what we'll do, as you can see, it's all accumulating over here in this corner. 
which eventually should just come on over into the bucket. So, further ado, we are going to water all the plants. It's getting pretty hot. I feel the sun on my face. So, more life to all, less life to none. I'm on.